looks like I found the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Versus what we used to have, the little Cushman. But we've got probably 100 plus yards of gravel to bring in to this mess. I'm gonna fill that ditch. Gravel all of this area. Everything where the truck's sitting. Probably a big wide area turnaround. Anyways, be lots of gravel, but cool old 1979 F600. Um, has the 370 Lima in it. Uh, 26,000 GVW. Best part about the whole thing is that right there. It's got Rockwell Deuce and a half run of gear. I think she'll lift 10 tons if I can fit it in the box. All metal box uh, with the removable sides. So we'll be able to haul hay on it. Got a grain door in the back. But I'll likely fab the gate to spread gravel. Box is in amazing condition. I don't think it's ever seen gravel, just grain. Got the grain auger. I bet y'all find something cool to do with the grain auger at some point. PTO driven. Maybe I'll put it on a little Cushman. Need some tires pretty bad. I mean, really bad. But can't have everything probably cost more to fill this tank than it did for the dump truck grain truck I'm sure somebody will beat me up about that but anyways inside's pretty nice I'm having a problem uh, the heaters the heater motor uh, right down there getting really hot it smells a little bit mousy in here so I suspect there's a nest in there so that's what I'll be doing today because it's gonna be raining off and on another cool thing about this truck right up here two-speed winch that might be worth close to what I paid for the truck anyways It'll come in handy. We'll be uh, pull logs. Got a sawmill that we're gonna set up here uh, when we start building, or before we start building. So I'll need to be able to haul some logs. I probably won't run much over 20 foot. That's a 14 foot box. So I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'm not gonna be hauling stuff for very far. So, anyways, 1979 F600. We get the heater box torn apart. Yeah, I guess we can hop up here and look at the motor. Engine. Need a step ladder. This is a two barrel. Oh no. Somebody's put a four barrel on it. I think it was a factory two barrel. Well, that's cool. Looks like it's got a four barrel holly if I'm not mistaken. Anyways, neat old truck. A lot of real estate under this hood for that small motor. Runs nice though. I bet you it would top speed probably be about 55 miles an hour. Maybe downhill loaded with a tailwind. Anyways, well, we get the heater box ripped apart, and we'll see you shortly, hopefully. Well, I got the uh, fan motor taken out. It wasn't a big deal at all. These old trucks are pretty easy to work on. No mouse nest. So, there goes that theory. 
pulled it out, worked it around a little bit. It's a little bit noisy. But it works. So, I'd tell you that I was probably going to replace it, but as long as it keeps working, we'll run it. Well, I figured, might as well fire this thing up. Test out the heater. It's a little foggy on the inside. One cool thing I'm noticing about this truck while I'm whomping around. It says 29,000 miles. Is it 129? Doesn't look look doesn't look like it based on the pedals and the floor mat. Barely anywhere on the edge of the clutch there. Gas pedal. Looks like new. Brakes good. Let's see. Hard to see. Yeah, 29,743. Well, let's see if she'll start. No choke. Look at that fancy stereo. Got enough shift knobs in here. Low range, high range, brake. Oh yeah, that thing sounds nice. Ah, maybe I will put a new heater motor in there. Blower motor. Got the cool uh, spotlight here. I don't know. Does it work? We'll see. Nope. Cool horns, but I can't figure out. Oh, they're air horns. If it's the pedal on the floor, that's the dimmer switch. It might be that pedal, that button. Got nothing. Control the hoist, PTO, engagement, up and down. It even has the. Uh, Owner's manual. That's kind of cool. What else? A uh, thimble and a lug nut. Start of a mouse nest. Well, heater fan quieted up. Maybe we'll keep it. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll monkey around with the uh, spotlight. I banged my head on it. enough times we'll either make it work or take it out all right well that's all I got on this video for now thanks for watching